All right, so they tell us the accompanying diagram shows the intersection of Broadway, right, this road right here, with 26th and 27th Street. So we're looking at the intersections of streets and avenues in terms of angles. They tell us the obtuse angle that Broadway forms at 27th Street. Here's 27th Street, right? Uh, the obtuse angle is an angle above 90, so it's either this one, right, here, it's obtuse, or the vertical angle here. They're both obtuse. They're both through the same angle. Um, they're telling us that that angle is five less than twice the acute angle, this angle here or here, that's formed at 26th, way in broad, 26th Street in Broadway. So if this angle right here is x, then this angle right here is five less than twice x, or 2x minus 5. So these two angles, um, they add up to 180. Because if you think about this angle and this angle being equal, right, they add up to 180 with this angle right here. They're supplementary to this angle. But this angle is an alternate interior to the one we're looking at over here, so they're equal. So that means that this angle x and 2x minus 5 add up to 180. So let's see what um, happens here. What's the value of x? x plus 2x minus 5 equals 180 degrees. That's 3x minus 5 equals 180 degrees. Add 5 to both sides, and we get 3x equals 185. I know 3 goes into 18, so I know 3 goes into 180 60 times, right? So it goes into it at least 60 times, but there's still 5 more to get here. We have 185. That's at least one more 3. So instead of 60 times, it's 61 times. And 3 times 61 is 183. So there's a remainder of 2, or 0 0.6, 2 thirds, um, or 0 0.6 repeating. So here the remainder is 2, that's 2 thirds, or 0 0.6 repeating, and this is the value of x. They want to know what are the values of the acute and obtuse angles. So the acute angle is the smaller angle, that's just x, and that equals um, 61 and a sixth, uh, 0.6 repeating, excuse me. So 61 and 2 thirds. Here, in the other angle, we have 2x minus 5, so let's evaluate that when x is 61.6. 2x minus 5. So 2 times 61 and 2 thirds, I like working with mixed numbers for operations, minus 5. 2 times 61 is 122. 2 times 2 thirds is 4 thirds, right? So here, um, 122 and 4 thirds minus 5, I think of 122 and 4 thirds as 122 plus 1 and 1 third. That's what 4 thirds is. So it's 123 and 1 third. Right? Those are equivalent. Minus 5. 123 minus 5 is 118. And we have a third. So it's 118 and a third degrees. That's the other angle. So if you add 118, right, and, uh, and a third, and 61 and 2 thirds, you will get 180 degrees. They are supplementary to each other. All right, thanks.